Hey, Park Lane Worldwide, welcome to the news at noon. It's week 20, it's May 16th, and the spring ring sale is extended for the whole May commission month with a qualifying purchase. They can get customers and get a number of fabulous rings for just 30. Now, what's new now? The Flamingo earrings. Oh, I've seen some of these already displayed on social media. With a qualifying purchase, they can buy them for this special price, between 18 and 24, depending on your country, as a customer special. That's new now, as is the Beaches necklace. For just 34 with a qualifying purchase, this is our sparkle surprise. And the Beaches necklace, item 13411, is a customer special and has limited quantity. Don't miss it like a few people who did the wild thing and they were sad. Hey, we are currently right in the middle of Founders Month where we celebrate our founder, Arthur Levine Sr. And all he did is a partner with his wife, Shirley, to create our great 64-year-old company. We'll talk more about that. We're in the final weeks for St. Martin. May Commission Month ends the St. Martin trip. Who knows what's next? You'll hear. We're going to recognize the top 10 points or qualifiers in our six-second shout-out. In May, continue one bonus item, the Mother's Day special, five, five Fast 50s for hostesses, our amazing hostess reward program, our Rich Rewards Club, Katie Earrings. These are so hot. And just $2,000 for you internationally gets you that new product of the month coming out, the Katie Earrings, and then you can sell it. And the people who earn these sell a lot of them because they have the new one soonest usually to show, which is exciting. Convention is still all the rage. And we're about two months away now from our convention in Chicago, Illinois. July 18th and 19th, the Marriott uh, Hyatt Regency right by O'Hare Airport. All goal-making franchises when you attend convention and your franchise has made its attendance goal. You all get the Living Coral Bracelet and the Impressions Design. Just a fabulous piece, in addition to all the other things you get. And whether you're there with us or not, you can qualify for all these beautiful sales awards with your sales during the May, June, and first two weeks of July commission months. So we just really started this. Awards for teams, awards for top personal sellers, even awards for placing tops worldwide or in our international markets. And if you're not there, you receive all these awards and gifts, but there is truly nothing like being called up on stage and being presented one of these amazing one moment in time awards. It really is incredible. All this can be tracked on a tracking. We've got a great tracking form. Those of you who love to do it manually, you can put it on your refrigerator. It's a great way to keep focused and it's in your Network Magazine, your main network magazine is there, and you should have printed a copy. There it will also tell you that we're in a four-week commission month, all of our European markets, all of you down under, and five weeks only here in North America from Mexico and Canada. And that takes us to our six-second shout-out. Congratulations. These are the top 25 point orders currently as of the 15th, as of yesterday, for the St. Martin trip. Rosa Guillen and Linda Rosa Montano, congratulations, Viva la Mexico! Two from our uh, Mexican country business. Abby Walsh from Australia, she'll tell you how an amazing a top 10 point earner trip is. They're incredible. And Wendy Jones, who just started the business in, uh, in January in our Jewelry Sparkles UK franchise, way up there in points. And congrats, Abby from Park Lane Rebels, congratulations. Very excited because they're going to be in that top 10. And that takes us to our one-minute training. We've been trained in the last four weeks on the four pillars, really the four things you do in your business that will grow your business. We started talking about booking, how it's a skill. It can be taught, and the more you do it, the better you get. How show planning is a discipline. You have to discipline yourself to do it, make it a habit. And once you do and you've got it, $1,000 shows don't just happen. They're planned to happen. We talked about how recruiting is a feeling, that when you're excited you recruit, you know that's true. And how much do we focus on the positive feeling that our business will give? And so in week number four, our last week, we talk about the last pillar, promoting. And promoting is a passion. And promoting is my favorite one. 
it says I'm all in. It's, it is really giving the best that's been given to you to others. And how early do you plant that seed when you talk to people about being a branch director or being a leader? Now, first, I want to talk to all of you stylists. I realize who my audience is. And if you are, you have to consider taking a promotion to branch director. And it's really easy. Sell so a thousand more net not in a month and have a qualified recruit and you promote. It really is that easy. Okay, only two things. But as a branch director, you receive more money for doing the exact same thing in Park Lane's compensation plan. You go from 30% to 35% commission. And if you, so when you go out and do a show, if you aren't willing to even consider that, when you get in the car and you're on the motorway on the way home, roll down the window, take a 20 and a 10, crumble them up, and throw them out the window. Because that's exactly what you did if you won't at least consider taking a promotion to branch director. More money doing the same thing. And if you decide doing the same thing was nice, but I want to build a little team, then you also make what we use in the industry, the term is called override. That's a percentage that comes from the company on your team, the people you share with. And as your business grows with Park Lane and our compensation plan, your income grows not just by volume, not just because you're selling more, but actually by percentage. Because at branch director, you can earn between 5 and 10%, depending on your volume, of what your team sells. So you don't just make more money because you're selling more. You make more money because you get a higher percentage. It is a fabulous part of our compensation plan. And really, to not consider it, and for me to not say you should, it would just be a sin if I didn't say that, because it really is. Now, this last training page is really for our leaders, and we're going to do a special separate video for all of our leaders to expand on all these points and to help you. But to create a promoting culture within your business, there are really five things you need to do. Number one, you need to identify early by asking new stylists at the initial interview. Now, remember we talked about positive choice questions during our booking training? Guess what? That works on everything. What I would say to someone is I'm, you know, they just decided to say yes to Park Lane. I would say, Mary, I'm so excited you're joining us at Park Lane. I just have one more question before we get everything going. Do you want to start just like as a little side gig to make a little extra money and get the discount? Or would you like to maybe, you know, just work a little bit more at it, not really a lot, and be a branch instructor in training where you can make uh, 35% commission and earn a bonus on your team? Which one do you think would be best for you? That's all. You, you say that at the initial interview. Um, secondly, you'll be amazed at how many people will say, oh, well, I want to do the branch instructor in training. And then joining with a friend becomes a huge area of focus to new stylists. People who have a promoting culture usually incentivize this, too. They have something special for people who bring in a friend at the beginning because it's just a much easier path to branch director. Number three, promoting uh, businesses with a promoting culture have a group event monthly where they share the leadership info with key movers and shakers. They don't invite anybody. They personally invite people they want to come here at. We used to always do this with couples. Every Friday night, it was Friday night pizza info. That's what we called it. We'd have them all over our house. And every month, we had, you know, lots of new people coming in. So every month we'd do this. And they got a personal invitation. It was only by personal invitation. And number four, at that event or whenever, we'd set short-term short, short -term goals and steps to get them promoted this month. So once they get excited, they need to have an action plan and you need to create that. And it's really easy. Say it with me. 1,000 or more net not in a month. One qualified recruit, that's it. And then fifth, they make promotion a big deal. Remember, in our business, you get what you reward and recognize. A Facebook post is nice. A Louis Vuitton bag is wonderful. But let's remember something. It's not people will remember how they felt with what you did more than they'll remember what you did for them. It's not really that Louis Vuitton bag as much as it's how you feel when you get that. Oh, my God, this is amazing. You can make people feel special a number of different ways, but the people who make a big deal about promoting have a promoting culture. You know, it is true in life as it is in our business. These four great pillars are really the four things you do to grow your business. And the habits you have in life or in our business will always be those you reap in life or your business. Thanks for watching this week's News at Noon.